In today's episode, you're going to get to see a beautiful 1962 Ford Galaxy. Hello everybody, welcome to Classic Car Chit Chat. My name is Kevin. If this is the first time you're coming to my channel, then welcome. I really appreciate you being here today. If you've been to my channel before, then as always, welcome back. Thank you so much for the comments you leave for me, for the thumbs up, you subscribing, as well as hitting that notification bell so you know when the next video is being released. Today, you're gonna to meet a gentleman, his name is Chris. He has an absolutely gorgeous 1962 Ford Galaxy 500. He's had it for about 30 years. This car is beautiful. It's been lowered. It's got this gorgeous white color, like a classic white color. It's got dual exhaust pipes and it's just stunning. So without further ado, let's hop in, let's go for a drive and let's check out this beautiful 62 Ford Galaxy. Look at this gorgeous car. Wow, Chris, she's beautiful. Rev the engine for me. Oh, and what's the horn sound yeah. like? Wow, totally different sound. Yeah. Okay, come on out. Wow, Chris. Yeah. Tell me what you have here. I have a 1962 Ford Galaxy 500. I bought it uh, back in 1988. I've owned it for 33 years. And I've done a few uh, things over the years. I've changed the suspension. It's actually lowered. Factory. Really? It's, so it's this a, is not the stock It's height. not stock suspension. Uh, it's lowered actually if an inch because I could buy the uh, the leaf springs are an inch lower. You could buy it that way. When they did the coil springs, they cut, had to cut them down. That's it. But it's all new suspension. It has dual exhaust. Uh, the way you see the interior is the way I got the paint. It's the way I got it. And the interior was redone. New carpeting was put in it. What about the ribs? These I bought because it had originally uh, the original white wall tires, the 14 inch. I went up, I found these old Krager SS's on Kijiji. Somebody in Oakville had them. So I got them for 400 bucks. Good for you. And what, I a put, set of four? Set of four. For 400. 400 bucks. And I just cleaned them up. And the lucky thing about these, the guy had them in his garage. Usually when you find these things, yeah. they're out in the outside. Right, in the elements. Right, the elements, and, the elements yeah, yeah, yeah. And, they're, and they're scrap. But I found these. I've just put, I went up to 15 inch because the, the old style, he had the ob gone, right? So you could put them, you could put them on anything. Okay. Ford, GM, Chrysler, right. they fit anything. Right. So I bought those, cleaned them up, put a set of 15 inch tires, radials on it. Oh, it made wow. a huge difference. It's absolutely lovely. Look okay. at the different elements, like even in the, the side mirrors. Yeah, like. there's lots of lots of stainless steel on here. Gorgeous. Lots of chrome. And like, this is, I, I changed a few things, but this is new. These are new. The one on the hood's new. And how do you find those things, like on uh, eBay and stuff? No, or? no, there's places that sell them okay. yeah, in the States that have them, yeah. You know what, though, Chris? I have a thing about fender skirts yeah, and cars I, I, where you get the wheels. You can't put fender them. skirts on them, but, yeah, but I'm not I love a big... this look. Yeah. Wow. And the chrome underneath of yeah, that again. Yeah, there's lots, lots of stainless steel on this car. <laughs> Beautiful. How cool is that? Absolutely gorgeous. I can show you under what I did underneath the hood. Yeah, we'll take a look in a second. Yeah. Let me get, oh. But the way you see it, it's the way I bought it pretty much. The guy redid the bumpers, basically stripped the car down. It's not the original color. The original color was like a tan color. This guy, this is a okay. GM Corvette white, apparently, but it's held up for the last 30 something years, so. You know what, it's got this beautiful, I like this kind of color because it's not a pure white. It's like a creamy, it, it, yeah, it's a it, soft. It, it did color. come in white and back in '62, but they call it a coronation white. Okay. So, and I can actually show you the original color when I let open up the trunk lid. Right. That's the only part that still has the original color. So, how big is the engine on this? Thing? It's a 352. 
which was a, a, an optional engine with the Cruise-O-Matic. The Cruise-O-Matic was also an option. Cruise-O-Matic is different than an automatic? No, there was different, there was a Ford-O-Matic, Cruise-O-Matic, different transmissions you could really? get for the car. And, and what, what did that really mean in terms of the differences? Uh, different uh, levels, like gear levels, high, like a third, like it'd be like a three-speed oh, type of I thing. See. And, and, and that's like a factory option. So yeah, they're fine, yeah. So this. And it also has, uh, option though two was the power steering and power brakes was also an option. What about air conditioning? Was that That was an option? also an option, which wow. I kind of wish it had because it's got the factory tint windows. Yes. Which you can see, yeah. I wish it did have factory. But I do like these. This is their version of yeah. air conditioning. And this, <laughs> yeah. And these are all new. I've changed all these seals. Yeah. All, all this and all of these all and the way around the, the car. The drip, uh, yeah. what do you call it, a drip tray? Or what is that actually called? Yeah, it's just, it's just drip, to catch drip, the water. Drip, drip rail, yeah. yeah, yeah. Beautiful, incredible. You know what I really love about cars like this? Are chrome elements yeah. like that. Like yeah, they like just make the car pop. This one, yeah, these, those, those are standard. There was actually an optional one that went up from here. It was very rare. Okay. This, this is a new, I changed, right. no, just, just the plate inside. Yeah. The chrome was all, beautiful. all done and I, I redid this grill. I took it out a couple of years ago and just kind of touched up where the black is. It's hard to see it in here, but yeah. yeah. Oh, I pulled out the whole grill, straightened it up as best as I could. Because getting parts for these are, or they're starting to make them, but they're very expensive. Where did you find the car then, Chris? Was it in Canada? Uh, yeah, I West? found it. I was just always wanted an old car. And uh, this one came along. I liked it when I saw it. And then, then I uh, just kept it. I did. Yeah. Why, why the Galaxy? I don't know. I just when I saw the I when I saw the car back it. back then, I just kind of looked at it. Well, and then this was like when I when you see it, it's the way I bought it, but with yeah. the original tires and white walls. But I kind of liked it at the time, so I was going to sell it, but then ended up keeping it. <laughs> and thir Thirty odd just, years 30 later, years later, and I still have it. <laughs> I've done a lot of work. I did a bit of work to it this year. Okay. Like the transmission's been redone. The motor hasn't, but okay. the, uh, the new dual exhaust on it. That's so where you get you, the keys. I can open the trunk. Yeah, I'm going to ask you to open the trunk and the uh, the front bonnet yeah. as well. Uh, before you open the trunk, I notice here. So this is all sort of chrome, but then yeah. the black yeah, is just I've, painted on, right? Yeah, it's painted on. But wow. I haven't had a chance. It's hard to get off because I'd have to I'd have to take the bumper. The screws are behind here. Yes. And they're really hard, so I'd have to take the bumper off. But and you need a steady hand to. Yeah, to do I could too. probably do it like this, but I haven't got around to, but I just kind of left it like this. This I've changed, the original one was cracked, but right. I found that used. But you know hurt. what, the tail light's lovely on this. And I've changed, yeah, these are all new, like I put all new gaskets back there. I've so changed. where's where's the indicator bulb on this? The whole thing would turn on. Uh, the reverse, oh, is that the reverse yeah, light? Yeah, right actually oh, that, wow. that, was, that was an option too. These okay. three first lights were an option to have reverse lights. Incredible. And again, the original car would have had dual exhaust as well? Uh, no. Oh, no, it's it's just a singular, okay. yeah, yeah. I think that was also... Gorgeous. Can we uh, pop yeah. the, uh, I can the show trunk you that. here? Oh, it's enormous. Yeah, that's, your, that's the original color. Oh, right. Yeah, right, right. That's so kind of faded, but that's the only left piece that's left of the car that color. I've still got the traces here and there. This is not the original mat. I've kind of changed, got it. changed the mat. <laughs> you know what? I see this yeah. car, car cleaner thing yeah. in every yeah, car. Yeah, I, know. I, just bought, I just bought a new one because my old one was like 30-something years Canadian old. Canadian Tire? Huh? Where'd you get it? Canadian yeah, Tire? I got that Canadian, yeah. Exactly. My right. old one was like, you know what? I think it's time for a new one. I agree with you. Yeah, I used to have the original thing. I kind of wish I kept the original carpeting, but I will eventually put it back, but okay. I just put it in this carpeting uh, for now. Kind of brown, kind of goes with the car. So. It's gorgeous. And how much the uh, about the uh, the engine? Um, the engine's been uh, the engine's all I haven't all I've done to the engine I redid the oh my god uh, yeah I redid the I put uh, used to be uh, changed the intake used to be two barrel put it to a four barrel changed the rocker covers oh they're beautiful and basically just cleaned up all in in here painted that firewall black and then just oh basically god. cleaned up in here. It came out, came out all right. Oh, it's yeah, lovely. Yeah. Yes, I love the covers though. Oh, yeah, those. Yeah, those I bought with the carburetor, the four-barrel carburetor on it now because the two-barrel didn't cut it. 
it was the, okay. The battery always go in this position. Yeah, yeah. In the original car as well. Yeah, yeah. Gorgeous. Yeah. I still got to put the, uh, the, I have the windshield wiper motor, but I got to put it into the firewall. But right. the other problem where the fire goes in the firewall is the heater core is right there. Okay. So I got to be careful which screws I use because I don't want to go into the heater core. True right? enough. I've take, had to change that once. another problem, yes. I had to change that once before and I was a chore taking it out. Oh, hang on a second. Now here's something interesting. Is that a window screen you got there? Yeah, for a bug deflector. <laughs> what a great idea. For a bug deflector, yeah. What a great idea. Yeah. I had an old screen we were thrown out a window, so well, you know, I also got another screen behind that. From there, so in front and back. And back, yeah. Look just, at that. Yeah, just oh, a little, I see that, yes. Yeah. This just happened to fit. I thought, you know what, I just, when I took it, I had to take this off to put it in there. I just slipped it it's in there, such, you know what? Such and, a and cool it, idea. It keeps the bugs out, you know. Absolutely. I like that I can drive it through the bug, but it helps a lot. Yeah. Because this rad, this original rad, I've had the rad redone a long right. time ago, but like this is new, I've changed this piece. Yep. On it. And anything Fantastic. I could. This is I've changed these and the rubber things there. Those are all new. This is new. I changed all yeah. of what I can. And the hood hinges I changed. Right. I still have the original set. But That's I just kind of just when yeah. I when I when I had the grill out, I painted this all just tight, touched up all black. Right. To kind of. Oh, it's it's kinda so go with the, cause the time so to go lovely. with the black with the in the bit of the car, right? Yeah. And then I threw the dice. People like the dice, but I got to get more. <laughs> I, one's broke. They go, oh, they, oh, look at the dice. Yeah, on look the at thing. the dice. They, they, everybody, yes. everybody loves yeah, these things. Absolutely. The other ones are broken. I, I, I have them on the, the oh, thing on too. The, uh, yes. Yeah, but the ones broken on this side, right uh, they both broke. But yeah, but people get a kind of get a kick out of that when they see the. May I take a look inside? Sure. I can open up the other one too. Okay, let, let's have a look at the back as well. Yeah, it's like a couch. Oh, isn't it? Oh yeah, look. Look at that. Look at the space. Yeah, yeah. Oh, it's gorgeous. I put the seat belts in because my kids were young, so I installed seat belts. So the originals would not have had any. No, seat, seat belts actually were another option back then. Even for the front, uh, yep. front seat belts? Yeah, so I put them in. I'm, I'm sure they're close to factories I can get. They're the color I bought, so I don't know if I put a, drilled them in the right holes. I, I was, <laughs> when I was drilling the holes, going, really, do I have to drill holes in the body? But I had to, right? Had what's, to, the, what's the plan for the Oh, yeah, I've got a new headliner. Okay. I just got to put it in, so I just... Uh, that's the plan to put it in. I just have is it going to be the similar kind of cloth? Uh, to no, so the original. Different... It's like a, it's like a vinyl kind of, the headliner. Yeah. Right on. Yeah, and of course of... they have to have the ashtray in the back too, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> There's one lovely. in the front where the dice is. Right. Oh, I love this. Yeah. I have a thing about bench seats as well. Yeah, like yeah, I yeah. just love them. So lovely. I don't use the radio. I put it in my own radio here. I just took it out so we wouldn't come on. So would that have been the original radio? Yeah. No. Yeah, it's the original radio. Wow. Yeah. Just AM? It, yeah, it did work. I haven't put it on for a long time. It's the old tube in there, right? It took right. forever. It didn't pick up any stations. <laughs> but w now, would it have been AM and FM or just AM? It was just AM back then. Amazing. Yeah, I think. But I just and it, it even has a clock in there. How about yeah, that? that's not working. That of course. Work. Yeah, that's just that de that's years. decoration. Well, well it's, every year. it's correct twice a day. Isn't it was, it? it 9 a.m. and 9 p.m. It used to work and then just stop. But so fine. you've got a little lever here for the air. So yeah. that's just the vent. Right, that's just a vent. Yeah. 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 Awesome. And the brake release is that yeah. the foot brake? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah. And the other pedal is your high and low beam. beam I'm yeah, assuming, I put right? the little foot things there just right. for fun. Like the gas pedal, like people used to do that. Yeah. You know, like and I put a little one on the indicator too. That is so cool. Just a. People go get a kick, kind of see that and go, because oh, yeah. everybody used to do that. The old, Absolutely. Yeah. And the old crate, you know, the mag and everything. <laughs> and you've got the aftermarket cup holder yeah, and yeah, well, the stuff holder. <laughs> you need something to put somewhere. Yeah, that's why they made Canadian tires, isn't it? So we can pick oh, up yeah, things yeah. like that. So, oh, she's beautiful. You know what? It's it's the little things that always kind of get to me, like the way they designed this. Yeah. It didn't have yeah. to be that way, but they did it, and it's yeah. so cool. So cool. It looks really like um, the theme continues, like the circular yeah. here and the tail lights right. and yeah. everything yeah. else. Yeah. Just absolutely beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Oh, what a machine. Okay. Can we... Uh, Those original door panels. I love it. A little rough, this, but... This coloring here. Yeah. And yeah. the seat. Yeah, color. this is close to the original. Okay. I think the original had more like a... 
like a vinyl piece in the middle. Right. But these are pretty close, Beautiful. and that kind of matches it does. the door panel. But these and are, it's so nice to see. Uh, yeah. The old, yeah. The old oh, it runs pretty smoothly. Yeah, yeah. I've had to change. The only thing I changed was the little rollers for the window. That's all it is. Beautiful. Very simple. Thank you. You know what's the coolest little things are things like this. Yeah. Right. And the glove boxes. It's just, it's just, uh, believe it or not, it's cardboard. Get it. Oh, I know oh, yeah, you're yeah, right. Yeah. I saw something yeah. like another car. Like, really? Back then, you figured it'd be metal. I know, no. right? Cardboard. Oh, my Yeah, God. that's a new that's a new glove box. But yeah, I couldn't <laughs> believe it's cardboard. No kidding. Right. Half the car is, three, one more whole car is metal. And yet, they put a cardboard. Oh, she's got a lovely sound to her. Yeah. I've been playing. I've been, I got a little problem with the linkage, so I've been playing with it a bit. So I think I had it too high coming here. So I just readjusted it again okay. when I got here. So I got to see how it goes. It seems a little bit better. I got to get the proper linkage, but I've got I've got it rigged up, right. so it should be fine. Okay, so we're gonna head outside again. Okay. And when we get. Uh, to Main Street, we'll hang a right and we'll drive through Streetsville. Very, very smooth, isn't it? Yeah, I think I tuned it up last year. I try to change the plugs every couple of years, not to, not every year. I used to every year, but it only, only really doesn't go far. It hasn't gone anywhere in the last year and a half, right? Nobody's gone anywhere in the True last enough, year and a half. Yes, we've been kind of confined to a... Mind you, in a car like this, we can easily do the social distancing thing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> wow. And we'll turn right here. She handles the bumps beautifully. Yeah, yeah, I, I had, I just had the suspension fixed. Well, not suspension, the exhaust. The, the way they did the exhaust, right? When they put it in, it went over a cross member. Yes. And every time I hit a bump, clink, 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 clink. <laughs> drove me nuts. I bet. So I just did a pile of work to this car uh, this year. Um, so they fixed that. Like I got the. Um, Transmission flushed out. They flushed out the brakes okay. fluid, put new brake fluid in. Right on. Did the differential, flushed that out, put new differential fluid in. Uh, and I had the new the power steering rack all done and rebuilt. Okay. So I spent a lot. I spent a bit of money on it this year, yeah. but slow and I've, steady. Right? I've, Just... I feel a little bit safer now that I know somebody yeah, else right. looked at it. Right. He's got fuel injection. I don't. Exactly. But you can get fuel injected carburetors for these. Oh yeah. yeah. Here we go. Chris, the sound is absolutely yeah, exquisite. I love it. Yeah, everybody it? loves it. Yeah, the, the exhaust you put on this is awesome. It's, it's a perfect sound for this car. It is. It's, you can tell it's got enough power. Yeah, and it's yeah. just smooth. Yeah. It's just, you know that that's one of the things I always kind of I'm lucky enough that I sit in so many cars and I meet people like you. Yeah, yeah. And yeah. you really get to hear the differences in the exhaust sounds. That, yeah. Like the audio will never quite pick it up. No, I, I, no. I recognize that, but to the ear you can tell. Wow, it's just a a lovely sound. It's a great rumble to yeah. it. Yeah. See how she takes Beautiful. the bumps here. Still working on the suspension. Oh, uh, way, way better than way, mine. Way, way, <laughs> Trust me. Yeah, in mine. It's better than it used everything. to be. Wow. So you know a lot about cars and things. Yeah, like, yeah. Are I've you always, a mechanic by trade? I used, I used to be. I used to. I used to be a mechanic. Not. I wasn't fully licensed. Okay. So I always worked on cars. Good and for Always you. loved cars. So. Do you remember the very first car you ever bought? Oh asked that before and I, my wife asked me that and I'm trying to remember what it was I had so many cars I, geez, I couldn't tell you really right. I don't remember what about the most memorable car that you ever had I think that probably other than the would, galaxy <laughs> uh, would have been I had a um, 80 no sorry 73 Olds Cutlass 442 that was a really Olds, nice car Olds Cutlass the Olds Cutlass 442 yes. but then I bought it and then uh, I started to the quarter panel started rotting out and I go, you know what, I'm not putting any more money. I didn't want right. to put any money into it at the time, even though the car is worth money now. But yeah. anyhow, at the time I didn't want to. I ended up selling it. Okay. And the next thing I know, I found out where it was and the guy painted it yellow. It was originally brown oh. and he painted it yellow and it looked like crap. Oh no. And it's like, well, whatever, it's your car now. Yes, exactly. I guess so, he's free to do whatever he wants. Yeah, but. I kind of wish I kept that car because it it's a money car now. But, yes. but you know, at the time I still actually I had this car too, so. But isn't that always the case? Like some, when you look back in retrospect, sometimes you think, "Oh, I wish I kept this. I wish yeah, I did yeah, that." Yeah. And 
And at the time, you obviously you, you can as, as a financial thing too, right? Yeah. And, uh, yeah. But well, if only, if only. Well, I had this one, I, like I said, for 33 years, but then I, uh, process of moving, I had to put it put it somewhere. I had to find storage right. because where where we were living at the time in the townhouse, I couldn't fit the car in there because right. I had to put two other cars in there, <laughs> and I actually found a place out in out by in Burlington, out by IKEA, out that okay. way. Yeah. Uh, lady had a a garage rent it was in a townhouse and i swear this garage was 30 feet deep really in a townhouse in a townhouse i couldn't believe it oh, wow. i could fit this car and her tempo one. in front of mine <laughs> wow it was huge and i and i got such an awesome deal with this lady she's really nice oh, until cool. we moved and she I was only paying like 50 bucks a month oh it was you like it was a steal that, that's so a gift right there it was a steal and it actually sat for oh you can turn in this street sorry uh, this one yep if you can. Uh, I apologize. Uh, sorry, what was it? Oh yeah, uh, so I ended up actually sitting for about, my daughter was born, I ended up sitting about seven, seven, eight years. Right, okay. yeah. uh, and then we moved and then I had to get it running because it was sat for so long. Yeah. I did actually, the all the wheel cylinders leaked and I had to change all the wheel. I had to call, I had to crawl underneath the car. Right. Do all that and get it running and then it finally brought it back to So when you saw house. this car, uh, Chris, this was, yeah. In Canada, yeah, and um, what were you looking for? Anything like we're just gonna go straight. Here. Oh, straight. Yeah. Uh, were you looking for anything specific other than just a little project for yourself? No, or? I've always wanted an old car. Right. Uh, like um, back then, we didn't have the resources we the resources yeah. we have now to look for a car. Like True. you know, I know what the funny cars are now, but yeah. back then, yeah, we went by in the newspaper. Yeah, for sure. That, that was it. There was no no way of knowing what was out there unless you kind of drove around and got lucky and found True. the car you're looking for. Yeah. And this one was just happened to come up. The guy was selling it, so I bought, I paid 3000 for it back back in 88. Back in the day, oh yeah, wow. Yeah. <laughs> and spend a whole lot more money on it oh, since, yeah, but there yeah, you go. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but I just had it reassessed through Haggerty because uh -huh. it's been only been worth for the last, oh, 30 years. Right. It's only been a uh, appraised at like 6300 okay which I thought was not enough and yep. I actually phoned them up like where am I going oh, uh, left here, left. Yeah. Um, so and um, so no this seems a little bit low so I phoned Haggerty and they said okay number one condition yeah 8100 going really okay so well, let me see what I can do I because I told him I wanted to about I want to try to get a cover for 15 he goes, yeah. well, let me see I can probably push it to 10 okay so I had to send him some pictures and documentation of stuff I got done yeah they put it up to ten thousand dollars. Okay. So my premium went up a whole sixteen dollars. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? I so gotta you know. be honest. Haggerty is the only way to go for yeah. classic cars. Yeah, isn't yeah. It? yeah. It's not a commercial for them, but no. we, we wouldn't be able to afford the cars otherwise. No, no. Definitely, it makes a big difference. It's left here. Nope. Keep going. Oh, keep going. Yeah. Oh, when yeah, you get right. to the oh, construction yeah. site. Oh yeah. Sorry. Yeah. That's okay. it. Yeah. yeah. No worries. Yeah. yeah so. But a good car. I used to bring my son out to a couple car shows. My daughter never really was into the car show. My son was a little bit for a while. Yeah. Then he got out of it, so I took him to a few shows. It's he used, good. used to go. He used to go to London a lot, but he used to, that Fleetwood Cruise used to be a big, huge show back right. in London. But he kind of stopped that. Wasn't that, that in that little barn? Not a barn. No, just... it's his own private property. This guy used to put oh, on, right, and he right, used to right. he used to bring in guests at night. He used to bring in like stars like Bobby Vinton and stuff like that wow. in there into his into the into the tent and stuff so he kind of stopped that he has his own car collection he's got like about he collects cadillacs oh that's right the cadillac yeah, guy yeah, yeah yeah that's all he has oh my god and they're all plated really yeah so all every all single one that's plated wow he's got an alva yeah he's, i'm yeah. just thinking you know what the the the, the cost of getting them plated to yeah. get them insured yeah. to make sure they're you can drive them yeah. is, is just yeah. enormous yeah but oh hey, yeah absolutely if you can do it why not no, yeah, sure. And then we turn left where that truck's coming. Oh, is he coming out? That is one big ass truck. Yeah, no, I think I'll let him go. Let him go, yeah, let him do his thing. Hey, I just noticed here, there's no side mirror on this side. No. So that, that was an option too, I right? think so. So only the driver's side. You'd think these cars would let the poor guy go. 
Look at that. Oh, yeah, I know. Are you going. kidding? No, you know what? People are in too much of a hurry. Oh, my gosh. Like, really? It's a Sunday. You're still going to get on, there. guys. Oh, my oh, God. fella. Honestly. Yeah, people are... Uh, this is getting worse. Like, really? Just slow down. You're still going to get there. I don't understand why everybody's in such a hurry. Because oh, wow. the thing, the next thing you know, you catch up to the guy at the lights anyway, so... Yes. What's the big deal? a little bit better because it seems a little bit better she you get, you absolutely get, fine to me <laughs> like, it's kind of like, i know but i could go by the generator light it's on a little bit but it's oh is that right but but when, once i get going it goes off i know i'm okay so when you say you're adjusting the linkage what does that uh, actually i'll do? show you i'll show you okay let's i can show you it's easier to show than to explain yeah let's be on you'll be able to see it <clears throat> on this side kind of under here this is linkage here from the throttle to here for the carburetor. That's what I've been playing with. So, so you there. do it mechanically on the outside. It's not on the inside. No, no, like that. no. So okay. that's where that's where I have to set. That's my adjustment. So I've had it when I came here, it was too tight. So it was yes. idling too fast. So then I, when I said I got here, I played with it a little bit and it seems to be okay. So I'm just going to leave it there. What I'm eventually going to do is try to get one piece. I bought I bought the one that thought it would fit, but the other end like this wouldn't fit in here. So I had to buy this to, to, to and adapt, work. but yeah. so, but it's, it's working now. Okay. So it's fantastic. And, and this is to help for the uh, carburetor, keep it from boiling over. Right. It's a little like bit heat. of a step, like a heat. Uh, yeah. Heat shield. Yeah. 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 Beautiful. Yeah. What a lovely machine. Yeah. Uh, this, this okay. style 63 was different. Kind of, they kind of flattened it out. In, in really? 63. So they actually yeah. made some modifications. Yeah. Too. Yeah. Like they totally like, Got rid of all the round and kind of. Just, I don't like the '63, but the '63 and '64 are the more desirable. Ones. I, I'm more about the roundness, though, honestly. Like I. But this, like, I think, one of the favorite parts of my car is this. I like this part. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Kind of the just way it comes the way up. That yeah. It's like, a, it's like a bullet, kind of yeah. like a. And it's the 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 curve and the angular part yeah, of that. Yeah. You're right. It's pretty solid car. Like I think they originally. I tried tracing it. All I know is it came from. I think it came from Texas, but. I'm try, I was trying, apparently, four years ago, had had a fire somewhere and a lot of files, bin numbers and shit, stuff like that was lost. So, again, Chris, I really want to thank you for your time oh, today. No, I, thank you. I had a blast with this car. I learn lots every time I meet somebody yeah, yeah, like yeah. you. And this is an absolutely thank beautiful you. machine. Uh, thank you for doing it. I so, for something it. that you didn't think you were going to have 30 years, it just kind of no, went No, I just, by, can, just kind of went there you go. gone. But she's absolutely gorgeous, yeah. and hopefully she'll last another 30, yeah, maybe even longer. I'm, my son's been kind of looking at it. When could I drive it, Dad? So, there you go. So. Right. So that's what you want. You yeah. want to encourage younger people to yeah, get Yeah, a lot of younger cars. kids aren't really into it. Not like no. it was 20 years well, ago. Well, they, they look for Bluetooth and all that kind yeah, of stuff. Yeah. But hey, you well, know, I have Bluetooth in it now. There but. you go. Yeah. <laughs> what else do you want? So, yeah, that's perfect. great. No, thank you so Good. much, Chris. Okay, thank I you. Really appreciate it. Thanks. Okay. Awesome.